And we're back at the 16 plus and I have a scuzzy hard drive connected to it. I will boot up the 16 plus from the hard drive and once I switch it on it will go through the uh, startup procedure very quickly as you can see. Loading system. And when it's finished loading the system you will see uh, the macro file 1 in the display and macro file and macros is what we will talk about in this video. When you format a hard drive you will be asked during the process if you want to put the operating system on the hard drive and also if you want to write the uh, Ansonic default file structure on the hard drive. And I said yes to both and here's the structure that it creates for you. Um, it has a root directory and in the root directory we have a directory sounds, uh, sequences, banks, sysx and macro file and in the sounds directory are two directories one for the factory sounds and one for my sounds and I will now navigate from the root directory to the sounds directory to the my sounds directory but before that I will show you the free blocks on this drive so in my system there is like 4085 blocks of free space and on the drive it's like a jackpot 3,980,407 free blocks which is roughly about 2 gigabytes yes okay let's go let's do it uh, we're going to we're on the hard drive and we're going to the my sounds so first we're going to sounds we press enter then there's two files in there and i want to go to my sounds and i press enter so in the structure we're now in the my sounds directory which is empty and i'm going to create three new directories in there so i look up my page create directory and there it is and i press yes and now we can rename the directory and the new name will be was a beginner's mistake sorry guys and girls <laughs> all right that's it I press yes and directory has been created so I create another one uh, we're still in the my sounds directory now we have created one directory I will create another one so create directory I'll give it a new name and I call this one virus KB so I can put all my virus KB waveforms in that directory folder so press enter yes and I'm gonna create a third one uh, let's call that one fair light yeah let's call that one fair light here we go a bit of typing but uh, we'll get there eventually so yes almost and here we go press enter or yes and we have three directories created so once we go back to um, exit to sounds exit to root so now we go back to the my sounds directory I press yes and we have three files in there and sonic a virus KB and a fairlight now that I have these uh, folders created I don't want to do too much of a menu diving when I want to go to a specific folder so that's why we create 
uh, macros or shortcuts to these folders. So I'm going to create a shortcut to the Ensonic folder by pressing load and keep it pressed. And then I press 1 and you see macro file in the display. Then I press yes and now it's assigned. So I'm going to do the same thing for directory 2 virus KB. I keep the load button pressed. I press 2. I keep the load button pressed and I press yes and it's assigned and then let's do the third one too so load keep it pressed press three the macro three appears press yes so now we have all those uh, macros assigned to these folders so say if I want to load them I just load press the load button and one or load button and two or load button and three and you will uh, to the, you will yeah, immediately go to these uh, folders so say that I'm somewhere here on the hard drive and I press load one I will go to the Ensonic folder and that's awesome now that I've created these shortcuts I want to save it and I want to save it so that um, the first macro file that's loaded loads this file so I call up the uh, save macro file page in the 16 plus I press yes and now I can rename the file but I want it to be macro file number one so I just press enter and that's basically it now your file is saved the next time you boot up from this drive uh, it will load this macro file